quiet. Yours. The whale road leads us home. Gods, it's about time. Run up Stop the and start rowing. Rather silent, Davor. Anything to say for the mess you led us to? We suffered no losses in this fight, and the men who humiliated us are dead. What is there to say? Oh, something like, I was stupid, selfish, reckless, blind, bone-headed, and I smell like blood and shit? I like my version better. Eivor, look! Someone is setting up an outpost on that island. Judge his men. Gnawing at any piece of open land like dogs worrying a bone. Even with you half in the grave, we could easily take them.
Bone. Let the sail out. Jackster, talk to Dex. <laughs> yeah, Gordito's a big deal. Literally in time, yeah. I went to want to check our pro cred, but to me it feels more like he tangled us up with Maelstrom and Militech. There's this combat bot, military prototype. Maelstrom clept it, then Dex paid to take it off their hands just before the Gangoons had a switch up in management. Aye, right, heard about that. Royce versus Brick, hostile takeover. That sums it up. Dex wants us talking to Royce. Gave the deets of some Militech agent too, but I don't know how much help she stands to be. <laughs> then there's the other thing. Gotta meet the client who put the job on the table. Evelyn Parker. You? Well, what's Dex gonna do? Ride around in his limo, check chicks up on the hollow? Parker wants to meet someone on the crew. Dex gave me the nod. They must know what he's doing. So, how you wanna play this? Maelstrom or Parker? What's first? I say we knock on Maelstrom's door first. Pound, actually. What a lay. any other, right? I'll take the Valentinos. They follow God and the Santa Madre. Honor means something to them. You know what they want, how they get it, and what pisses them the fuck off. With Maelstrom, you just never know. Go on, let them know we're here. I want to talk to Royce. Dex sent us. Uh, cozy place. We could use a few plants, though. Oh, yeah. They look damn well prepared. Don't think I've ever seen security like this in a chow factory. Uh, gear from the Jack Convoy. Gotta be. 
I must have been all over it like maggots on dead meat. You hear about their boss, Royce? Dex mentioned him. <laughs> Called him special. MT0 D12 called the Flathead. And? The hell you care? Guy I represent already paid brick for it. I'm just here for the pickup. I can talk direct to Royce if necessary. Nah, you talk to me. Name's Dum Dum. Now, couch, planet. Down for a Jack, bullet. sit down. This ain't gonna end well, but... Come on, take it. Thanks, I'm good. <sighs> Whatever you say. Here we go. Flathead. Model MT-0 D-12. Militech's not gonna come looking for it? Fuck them. They can hop around and try. We're removed. Need to see it. Suit yourself. Fucking tricked out this thing. Dynamic thermal optic camo armor. Full cognitive immersion with a Raven controller. Pimped up and watched. Fully integrated link. Mm hmm. So, what you think? Yep, we'll take it. Free. Sure. Yeah. Brick got it. It's all paid up. Brick got it. <sighs> I don't see any fucking brick around here, do you? Come on. Can't expect me to pay for this thing twice. And who the fuck are you to say what can and can't be? You'll pay twice because I say you'll pay twice. All right. You want the flathead? I better see some eddies. I'm talking to you! Seeing as you already got the eddies for it, you ought to offer us a discount. A big one. A discount? Fuck. You know, you never did say who sent you. Never did say who you're working for. Dexter Deshawn. That's who. Dexter Deshawn. The lord ass who punching animal fucked half a Pacifica? <laughs> he ain't dead? No. He's alive, well, and kicking. And he sends his regards. So you gonna consider my offer now? <sighs> mm -hmm. Bang. Cut me Bring it, cocksuckers! Oh, unload on them, B! Cut loose! Oh. Where's they come on? Oh. Ah. Nice! Mierda! Cut off! Grab the gear! Body control shard! Quick! Gotta find a way. Got the set. Bot and controller. Then let's go! Quicker the better! Now let's get out of here. I'm dying for some fresh air.
Will it fail this meat? Ah, I can taste it. It's a production line. Plus, I thought you loved me. Really no other way. Time's over!
Yoshi Springs. Perhaps someone at the inn can direct me to Sensei Ishikawa. Samurai? Alive? I'm looking for Sensei Ishikawa. I thought he fell at Komoda. He didn't. Where is his dojo? To the forest. I can show you the way, my lord. Did the Sensei not fight at Komoda? No. He came to town for surprise the day before the invasion. Hardly spoke a word, but he's always been a private man. My lord, are the stories of Sensei Ishikawa true? What stories? They say he sank a pirate ship with a single arrow. <laughs> Not the ship, but he shot a pirate captain from the shore. Routed the whole fleet. I hate to cross an archer like that. Do you deserve death? I hope not, my lord. Then you're safe from Ishikawa. The Sensei's dojo is up there on the cliff. Thank you. I'll take it from here. One more question, my lord. May I ask why the sensei left his post as archery master to clan Nagao? No one knows. Strange. Giving up service to a great lord for... this. Sensei Ishikawa's dojo. There was a struggle here. Better look around. Someone was wounded. Remove the arrow. Dried blood. The fight wasn't recent. Bloody footprints. The victim or the attacker? Maybe the sensei is in his house. Humble home for a samurai. Don't move, Sensei Ishikawa. Lord Sakai's boy. <laughs> you survived Komoda. We could have used your bow. I was on my way when bandits attacked me. Are you expecting them to return? A samurai is never caught by surprise. <sighs> I'm sorry about Lord Shimura. He was a good man. He's alive. Taken captive by the Mongols. Then there's hope. That's why I've come. Help me save him. I can't. My student is missing. A skilled archer. I will help you look. Then you can both help me free Lord Shimura. Hmm. Try and keep up, Sakai. <laughs> 